everyone and welcome back to episode 2 of Jurassic World Evolution number 2. I hope you enjoyed the first episode and now obviously we're into the second episode now of mission number 2. Um, yeah, just go ahead, slap a like on the video, subscribe if you're new around here and I hope you enjoyed the video. So right now we're about to take out, um, we're about to tranquilize some Carnotauruses here. We got two of them to trank. Oh, this one's running away. Come on. Come on. Aha, good night. Oh, really? Just as an organization has key players... Right, right. <laughs> It also has key facilities that it needs to run effectively. So you should get started with the construction of an arrival building, a control center, and also a backup generator to supply power. Yeah, well, hang on. First things first, mate. I am going to make this enclosure for the Carnos much more... Bigger. Do that way. Come out this way. Not the best fence in placement, but it will do. I mean, the first car mode's already in there. Right, so an arrival point is the first of many. We're gonna slap that there. Then. Right, let's just... Right, we're demolishing all of this. Oh, I hear Rexy in the background. Oh. Oh, yeah, boys and girls, whatever you do, please. No spoilers. Right, now... Now a control centre. Which can go there. And then a backup generator. Which is going to cozily go right there. We are going to put a gate right here. I'm just going to make a random path. Wait, no, not here, about... Yeah. About here. So then you can go... to about... there. And then there. And then... That's it, that's all built. Not bad, if I do say so myself. And I guess I am, but we're also going to need a response facility. Yeah, I'm... Your response to this directive should be to get one built. Yeah, uh, we're building that there. right <laughs> now, mate. Response, response. Uh, never mind. Don't respond. We'll build you right here. Then we'll path you. Right there. See, because once that's finished building, we can uh, go and quickly repair that fence. Claire, we need to get the dinosaurs into new holding enclosures. The ones we've already captured. Yep, that's right. And we'll want them awake and as comfortable as possible. Yeah. Looks prepared. Right now we're going to transfer uh, you Asset into there. 
Uh, right, through my playthrough with my son yesterday, I know they like sand. So we're just going to quickly whack some sand in there. Like so. Make the water a bit bigger. We'll put the we'll put the viewing gallery around here. No. Where right there. There we go, right there. Get the path. Oh wait, hang on. Let's uh remove that. Yep. Off. Delivery has been completed. Off right there. Then get a live prey feeder right about here. Right, we'll take control of the car now. out Meow. oh yeah see that drifting right there see straight away because I knew what I was doing I remembered from yesterday whilst playing with my five-year-old son yes yeah, straight away they had dangerous animals here correct mr. Finch we know where they were but now mr. Grady it's essential that we know where they are. I know my dinosaurs. I'd say they're headed off in this direction. And do you know your dinosaurs, Mr. Grady? Better than anyone. But and now we've got to search for signs of an escaped dinosaur. Well, you're just going to have to trust me on this one. Oh. This looks promising. You know, Keep driving. Not that I'm promising anything. Damn it. Oh, it's straight through the trees, yeah? Large carnival. Everything points in this direction. Let's see if we can keep going at top speed. I'm just going to spam X. Oh, no! Oh, wow! The crew member got yeeted! Oh, he's back in the van! I wonder where he landed. I was well going fast as well. Dodge. Oh, oh, the ball. about the dinosaurs, but they're not subtle. Wherever they go, they leave a mark. Sounds like someone I know. Oh, wait. Out of the way, Triceratops. Alvin, that guy, he is out there. Talk about an ego. Hmm. As opposed to... Well, you know, a certain lovable animal behaviorist whose humility has a charm of its own. Oh, it's an Allosaurus. I feel like we're getting close. I feel like we're getting close as well. Don't worry, mate. We're going to handbrake turn this. Ready and go! Yeah! Check us out. Allosaurus. Just be ready for anything, all right? The brackies in the background. Ready. Yeah, the Saurus is here somewhere. Ambush! 
There he is. Quickly, not too quick. It'll trigger their instinct to chase. Now move, move. Owen, Owen, are you okay? What is happening? Little busy right now. Please tell me you have things under control. Do you want me to lie? If it'll calm my anxiety, yes. I'm a bundle of raw nerves. We're working the problem. Give me control of the helicopter. We have a helicopter standing by, and they'll attempt to tranquilize the animal from the air. Attempt? Attempt? <laughs> we need success, Dr. Dua, before it can eat Grady and um. the others. No, please don't say that. You believe in the team, right? Right now, let's build an enclosure for the Allosaurus. Uh, yeah, it can go here. Can we just take a moment and look how amazing these Carnotauruses look? Oh, just look at... Ah, oh, Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous dinosaurs. Absolutely gorgeous dinosaurs, man. There you go. Add task, status check on you. Oh, he's injured. What's he got? Right, so he's missing forest, water, and prey. So it was. I'll put some forest. There. Then. No, sorry. Yeah, the water. Go around. I'm going to need a paleomedical facility to Go assess there. the status of the dinosaur that they're bringing in. He's missing prey. We'll need to do a full medical scan. I want to understand what went wrong if we're going to avoid an event like this in the future. And then the little bagger. Can have a view and gallery for himself here. Uh, give me that path. Absolutely gorgeous game. Ah, uh, right. Okay, so paleo medical facility. Here we go. Give me it's in water. Where? It was the only place where terrain restraints wouldn't affect it. Oh, look at him. He's badly been out, isn't he? Look. The detail that's gone into it, though. Absolutely amazing. Right, let's speed this building up. Right. Now we got a... Sometimes what a problem requires is a new set of eyes. Let's hire a few scientists with the skills to diagnose these animals. Make sure they are competent with the MVU and can perform medical scans on the dinosaurs. I've got to fire you, sorry. To see what we can discover. Combined welfare of free. Oh, you. You'll do. We've hired more scientists for Dr. Dua. So medical scan! So we handle on the dinosaur's medical status. Hopefully we'll be able to figure out what went wrong. Hey, if I've learned anything, it's that these animals are unpredictable. Like people. But with uh, bigger teeth. Yeah. We should keep an eye on her. Right, right. Uh, who? Dr. Dua? Yes. She's working for the CIA. I've just got here. a major fracture. Well, pleased to know I'm running a little intelligence op of my own, looking out for the both of us. <laughs> You're a lot more astute than out of here. Have on. Smarter too. Look at the Gallimimus just cruising. I'd suggest a tranquilizer, but you know, <laughs> you do you. Should be air tranked. Yep. 
Right. Now that we have control of the dinosaur, temporarily, let's get it transported to the Paleo Medical Facility, where we can treat its injuries. Yeah, we'll move it there right now. You. Yeah, we'll fast forward that as well. What's snowing? Yeah, were these two just fighting? Transporting asset. Oh no! The snow's made it go down again. Oh, we're going to add you to a patrol. Oh no, there we go. Fantastic. They're fine. You leave it alone. Speed it up. Fifteen seconds left. There we go. Heading to pick up the asset. Fast forward again. Part of the healing process is to get some rest, preferably someplace comfortable. Always works for me. Same for the dinosaurs, I'd imagine. You imagine correctly. Not according to my ex. Hmm. Yes, moving on then. We want to have the animal transported and then secure and comfortable in its enclosure, if you please. Here we go. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, just look. Look. Just look how beautiful it is. How do you take photo? Mission 2 done, ladies and gentlemen. We'd worked to make sure the dinosaurs would thrive in the forest. At first, I believed this was for the best. Then we realized that forest makes up about one-fifth of the total land mass in the U.S. and almost 40% of Canada's wilderness. Working together with the DFW and the CIA, we made the dinosaurs feel right at home. In the forest. <sighs> I really hope the powers that be know what they're doing. Because the dinosaurs definitely do. And with that being said, guys, we're going to end the episode off here. Thank you for tuning in today. I hope you enjoyed. Remember, like, subscribe, and comment. Let me know you're enjoying the series. With that being said, keep smiling, stay positive, and peace.